Karens are known for their public freakouts, and boy, do they deliver. They can be seen going off on anyone, from store clerks to restaurant staff, and even complete strangers. From screaming at the top of their lungs to pointing their fingers aggressively, these Karens know just how to make an entrance. So the next time you encounter a Karen in public, think twice before you startle her. She might just have something up her sleeve. So, picture this. It's November 2nd, 2022. An officer is out and about doing his daily rounds when he spots a couple of ladies strolling down the road. One of them rings a bell. She might have an active warrant out on her. So, he pulls over to check if it's really her, but ends up getting the old merry-go-round instead. Here's how things played out. I have no idea, sir. Have you done something wrong? Yeah, I believe you got a good. warrant. We're walking? What's your name? Have I done something wrong? What's your name? Wow. My name is, have I done something wrong, sir? Yeah. I don't have a warrant. I know that I don't. Then what's your, just tell me your name and then I'll My let you go. My name is Tori. Tori what? Tori Denig. Your name is not Victoria Because I know Victoria So tell me your name. I don't have a warrant, sir. You're not have Victoria D. You're not Victoria D. Have I done something wrong, sir? Yeah. What's your name? I haven't done anything wrong. What is your name? Because I think I know your name. I don't have a warrant. What was your birthday? Have I done something wrong, sir? Yeah. What's your birthday? Have I done something wrong? Yeah, you have a warrant. I what's don't your, have a warrant, sir. What's your name then? I have I done something wrong. Okay. What's your name? Have I done something wrong? Huh? Have I done what something I wrong? I live right here. I mean, Where do you live? I live it's right here on the middle street. street. What's the middle street? The middle street is Pine Street. That's my dad's. Okay. Tell me your name, because you're not Victoria mm -hmm. Denig. Have I done something wrong? Go ahead. Have I done something wrong, sir? I believe this is Alexandra. No, sir, that's not. Me. She won't give me your right name. She already gave me a fake name. Come back over here. Now, get, just show me your ID. I don't have an ID. Then what? Then I'll what's your birthday? Us and I'll get my ID. No, no. Have I done something wrong, sir? What is your name? I haven't done anything wrong. Why are you? Do, why are you harassing what? me? I'm not harassing you. You are harassing me. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. You are harassing me. All right. If you if, just give me your name. Sir, you are harassing me. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. Can you record this? Can you record uh, it's this? being recorded. Can you record this right now? Because I don't understand why. I don't either. I haven't done nothing wrong, sir, and, and you are harassing no. me. Right well, you're not Victoria and Nick, so. Sir, listen. Uh -uh. I, listen to Turn me. Around. Wait, 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 wait. wait, 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 wait. I, I haven't done anything wrong, Put sir. Put your hands behind your back. Please, sir, I have Stop. not done anything wrong. Put them behind your back. Please. Sir, I haven't done it. I will, I will. Wait, wait, wait. Stop. Sir, wait, wait. Put, I haven't done Put the done cigarette out. Don't burn me. I'm 1031. I'm going to get tased. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. Put them behind your back. Put them behind your back. I'm sorry. What did I do? What did I do? What did I do? Yep. I got Jimmy Yeager's name tattooed on me. What did I do? Taylor Floyd. I'm sorry, sir. I'm so sorry. She's security and clear channel. It is Alexander. What can I do? Huh? What can I do to get out of this? Huh? No. Nothing. You lied to me? I'm sorry, sir. I don't want to go to Marion County. It's well, a horrible place. No. I, I can give you Stay on the ground for a minute. I can give you any information you need. No. I you're can't, you're past that. Please, sir. Please. I can give you anything you need. No. I'm sorry, okay? I can do good no. No, you lied to me. You lied to me. Oh, I told you. I can give you good information. I, I don't need your information. Sit up. Sit up. What do you have on you? Sit up. Here, sit up so we can get in the... Sit just like that. Oh, she was in that yard with the camper. But she got, she got tased. Don't on, feel too good to do it. No. Oh, it made her stop. There's the open. I actually missed her. I gotta get my puller to pull that one out. You know, just hang tight with her for a minute. I saw her walking from back there, and I said, "Damn, that girl's got a warrant." And I was like, 
she don't look. She looks the same, but different. I mean, she looks different than what she used to. And then I, they walk over there, and I said, "Hey, what's your name?" And she said, "What'd you say, Jody?" Jody was the first name that you said when I pulled up next to you. And then when, and then when she got over here, get this, she told me her name was Tori Denae. And I said, "No, you're you ain't Victoria Denae, because she's last I knew she's still in jail." So, Who's that? Uh, this was her friend that she was walking with. I already ran her. Hey, you're good to go if you want to take off. No, I'll leave them there. I gotta take a picture of them. Where you gonna go? Lake County? She's going to Lake County and then she's gonna to go to Marion. Well, you got a Marion warrant? Ultimate final destination? Yeah. Will you take care of my room, please? I love you. I got you. I love you guys. Thank you. Uh, and you should phone to me. That's something just, you're gonna have to take care of it eventually, so. I know. That's something minor and simple. It's just petty theft. We got a warrant for it. I used to work there, so I, well, I used to so work for bad. Bellevue, so I know exactly all about Mary County. It's, Mary County. it's, so it's a little That's, better now. They, you know, I think you get to have commissary and stuff now at the jail. It's not straight four walls and a cot no more. Terrible. Yeah, but you ain't got to be in long. It's just petty theft. How long do you think I'll be there? You know, the quicker someone can get you bond out, you be in and out. I can't get one because I have FTA. Oh, and then you just got to wait till you see the judge and then... I don't know how... I, mean, I have 45 days in now. You have to do a mandatory 45 days? I already have 45 days in. So maybe they'll count that towards this. Maybe. But being on the run is not the option. Because stuff like... Do you really want to walk around and got to look over your shoulder every second? No. Yeah, they're right there. I don't really know. What they're gonna do? Cause I'm gonna. They don't have the tool to pull that taser probe out. Hold on. Any other injuries on you? Well, she hit this right here. No, she. It just stopped her. Cause she only got one probe in her. And then she went to the ground. Once I was right on top of her. She's lucky both didn't get her. I know it's these stupid. You know the pro, like what you, how you had that problem. Mm -hmm. It's that that's the problem is because they go so wide. You know. And then he did a moment. We got time to switch. Well, it. I was, I thought I did. Yeah. yeah you got to be far, far back. Well, you just got pains. I got the puller here to pull it out. It's just one right here. Yeah, you can't, you can't take hey. them out. You can't? Yeah, you can't take them out. You gotta hold them. Oh, what's that? This one? That's an empty one. This is the, this is what's stuck in her. So where's the other one? It should be, is it two? It's right there. It's, just, it's right here. It's just two. Okay. Okay. All right, have a seat on there. These. I should try to run it from me. My first day back, I'm and she makes me run. You made him run? This Karen got charged with playing the old wrong name game with a cop, otherwise known as providing a false name to a law enforcement officer, and for playing hard to get during her arrest, minus the violence. I've seen a couple of things in your wallet that look like driver license. Can I see the rest of them? Poor choice. Real bad. Really very stupid. All right, I see you crying. Okay. Did you know that possession of a uh, counterfeit driver license is a felony? As a student at the University of Central Florida was entering the campus by car, they were stopped by authorities due to a blockage on their license plate. When asked for identification, the driver unintentionally revealed that they possessed multiple forms of ID, including a counterfeit one. Oops, here's how things played out. Black Mazda. Go up to the light, then turn right so we don't get hit. Pull up about a foot, please. Pull up. I'm still in the roadway. I don't want to get hit. Hi, good afternoon. Sergeant Larkin with the police department, may have a license registration. Stopping you for something we call obstructed tag. The border around your license plate is covering the word New Jersey. It's not legal to have in the state of Florida. Oh. Yeah. 
I've seen a couple of things in your wallet that look like driver license. Can I see the rest of them? That one right there looks like maybe Connecticut or something. Oh, I was right. Cool. So this looks pretty fake to me. Same name. Date of birth 43004, but this says 2001. So when I run this, this is going to come back no record found, right? Yeah. Right. Did you know that possession of a uh, counterfeit driver license is a felony? No. Yeah, it's a felony. Like you could be arrested okay. right now, handcuffed, and taken to jail. Okay. Poor choice. I'm sorry. Real bad. Really very stupid. Okay. Where'd you get it? Online. Like a website? Fake driver's licenses or something? Yeah, I think this is the right registration. It is. Okay. Yeah, I'll take it. So, cool thing is, is I was probably only going to give you a warning about the tag, but now we can talk about this whole felony thing. Okay. We've never seen any of our things, you know, fake to felony. We have signs up around campus, don't have fake IDs, it's a felony. I mean, it's got little, like, bubble character and a jail jumpsuit. Never seen any of this stuff. Cool, okay. Well, like I said, this is a felony. So are you a student? Yeah. Cool. So um, you're going to get a student affair referral because you have committed a felony. Okay. okay but I'm going to tell you right off the bat, I'm not planning on taking you to jail. Okay? This gets to go away. I'm still okay. going to run it. It's all being recorded on my body camera. But when you open your wallet, we look for these things. Right? We use it for drinking or what? Yeah. Cool. Okay. I appreciate you being honest. That goes a long way. Right? Had you fed me some lines or lies or whatever. Um, I probably would have made things a lot more difficult on like being lied to, but okay. So the whole thing about the license plate, when you cover the word New Jersey, I can't see it. We have cameras that pick up these things when you come onto campus, but they can only read characters. Say somebody is a wanted murderer and they have a Missouri license plate with that same one matching, and the officers don't know, guess who's getting chased down and pulled out of the car with guns drawn on her? That's got to come I, off. I didn't know that. Okay. I'm really a lot sorry. of people don't know. It's a $114 ticket. I may or may not write it, but I'm still going to run your info. Okay. How's your driver record? Uh, I think... Yeah? No tickets? No. Okay. When's the last time you got pulled over? Um, maybe last summer. Okay, what for? Speeding. Oh, okay. I... Well, hey, you weren't speeding today, so that's a good thing. Uh, where'd you get stopped at? Um, at home in Upper Township, New Jersey. Oh, okay. I don't know about New Jersey being, um, you know, the obstructed tag thing, but our statute says your tag, the state, the characters, um, for those of us that have the validation tabs, the little yellow stickers, all of that has to be clean, free of dirt, debris, grease, grime, and mutilation for distance visible no less than 100 feet. When you cover the word New Jersey, most people can't see that. I could see it. I have many tags memorized, but Florida has over 200 types of tags now, so when okay. people cover that, I'm like, I have no idea. But again, the yeah. big thing is, is we get a lot of cars come in, they get hits on these license plate readers, and then we got to try to find the car. It sends the cops on a wild goose chase, all because we could have figured out that the thing said New Jersey and not New Hampshire. So you know I mean? if I just get that taken off... Yeah, absolutely. It's, it's probably just held on with the same screws from your license plate, yeah. but... We've been, like, we had one today, and I recognized it. I wasn't even here, but thankfully my radio worked, and I got the email. Mm -hmm. I was in Brevard County, and I heard it, and I called out. I'm like, uh, no, that's an 8, not a B, because it's a computer. It can only recognize characters. It's not perfect. But the cops were going to go chasing after somebody who, you know, looks like they're up to no good. Yeah. So um, I'm going to run your info. Obviously stay here because you're not free to leave, okay? Got a Connecticut one. It appears to be fictitious, but I'll copy a Connecticut number. Yes. Zero four two. Riley is negative and valid, and the Connecticut deal cannot be found. Hi, Miss. I appreciate your patience. Are you okay? Yeah. All right. I see you crying. Okay. If this is your first time getting in trouble over something like this, probably not going to be a big deal, okay? This is a college. Believe me, this isn't the first one I've seen. And that's how immediately after you pass it in your wallet, I already saw it. I've been doing this a long time, okay? We know what we're looking for. We see this stuff all the time. All right, traffic stuff, first off, your license is valid and there's no warrants or wants on you, okay? I'm not going to write you a $114 ticket when all I really want is your pink, glittery, rhinestone thing either gone or moved 
I don't know how you want to do it, but if you can mount it and keep it on there to work to where the word New Jersey is clear and visible, but keep in mind our cameras are like kind of high up, so maybe just take it off. But we want to be able to see that, and we want to make sure that you know. Okay. I, mean, I don't want you to get chased down over something as crazy as well. Your tag came back, but it matched another state. Okay, that's why I do this. Um, 114 bucks, not doing that. I am obviously seizing the license, that's evidence. I'm not charging you criminally, okay? But understand that I could have, and everything I needed, body cam recorded. That being said, anytime any of our students are involved in criminal activity, even if I wanted to cut you the biggest break in the world and say, you know what, I'm not gonna do it, I would get in trouble for that. You have to talk to student affairs, okay? Um, they're gonna contact you via your information on file, I don't know if it's, you know, in person or, you know, virtual, whatever. Um, but you're going to have to go before, you know, the student board and explain the goings on and they can choose to sanction you in a number of ways because you committed a felony. They could technically throw you out of the college. I've not heard of that happening, but I will tell you all of the results of student affairs are kept secret from us. So whatever happens, I will never know. Right. So I can't tell you that people have or have not been unless it's so egregious that like student affairs calls us in to issue a trespass to that person on the spot. So if that happens, you know, but again, I'm telling you on camera, I haven't seen it, okay? We're a college, we expect fake IDs. It's just, it happens to be a pretty high level crime for what it is. You season it, you'll hear from student affairs, whatever they decide to do, it's on them. You might have to take a class, you might have to write a letter. I have no earthly idea because again, you know, I never see or hear from any of those folks again. Do you have any questions for me about that? Um, do I have to take the license plate off now or can I <laughs> no. keep driving? <laughs> okay, so I will tell you technically, if you continue to drive with that and somebody else sees it, you can get stopped because you're obstructing the word New Jersey. Okay. That being said, if it's any of us, you're like, hey, Sergeant Larkin, just stop me. I'm on my way home to do it. Okay. Unless you have tools in your car, like I have tools in my car. I don't recommend trying to do that right here and right now. Okay, how far are you going to go home? Um, Where do you live I locally? Live in Libra. Oh, okay, so on campus. Yeah, but okay. I was going to go to the gym. Okay. But my dad's coming tomorrow, so okay. he can probably... Does dad have tools with him? Off. Okay. If, if not, you know, I'm sure somebody could help you with that. Again, it looks like it's just held on by the two screws for your license plate. So those come off, take the border off. I've told other people hey, if they want to drill holes so that, it, you know, the, drop, the tag drops a little lower or... It's up to you. I mean, I get it, you know, to stylize things. We sell them on campus, you know, in the store, you know, UCF Knights, yeah. and it covers the word Florida. And it's like, you probably, if you look at the packaging, it says, you know, check state and local regulations, blah, 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 because they're not legal here, okay. right? Or if you put it on a front plate, we don't care about that. Okay. We're looking at the back tags, because when you drive on a campus, you go past the little cameras, it takes a picture, it runs it, and tells us if you want it for murder, and so on and so forth. Okay. So, um... I would say you could leave it, but you could get stopped anytime between now and whatever, okay. right? There's only a couple of us doing traffic at the moment, so probably okay, but as long as it's on there, it's a violation. Okay. Don't know too many people that write the tickets, but since we've been getting a lot more of these, these bad hits, I'm pulling over every vehicle that I see that has that, you know, blockage on it, because we want to avoid that. Okay. Any other questions for me, comments or concerns, you feel okay? want to sit here for a little bit and chill that's fine too you look like you probably need it but again you're not being charged criminally okay. I would I would definitely not repeat what happened today okay, okay. right you, you know how much longer ago was it a, a year and some change 2004 and this is 23 so okay maybe it's like two years but look we know okay but you don't want to get caught with that stuff the other cop if they decided they wanted to make a felony collar, easiest one in the book, right? You're good to go as soon as I move my truck, you're good to leave if you want. If you want to stay here for a little bit, you're fine too, okay? Have a better day. Sports on University. <laughs> 98 with a verbal for obstructed tag. SAR sees the counterfeit deal. The officer on duty who is as polite and professional as a butler at a royal tea party, mirrored the driver's respectful attitude. The lady behind the wheel was also as fast in dishing out the truth as a chef serving hot pancakes. 
According to our noble lawman, these were the reasons he decided not to inflate this stop into some grand drama worthy of a primetime soap opera. Good job by both parties involved. She's putting gloves on and they smell bad and I don't want to touch my body! What are you doing to my body? Guess what happened in the Sunshine State on April 9th, 2022? Our story begins with a lady enjoying a cold one right out there in public. Now, according to Florida law, that is a big no-no. You can't just sip your booze wherever you please. The boys and girls in blue spotted her and decided to have a chat. But Miss Karen Beerenhand wasn't having any of it and decided to take a stroll instead of sticking around for some friendly advice from our officers. So, what do you reckon happened next? Let's dive into this hilarious tale. Hello. Hey. What are you doing? Hanging out. Okay. With your uh, beer? Is that not okay? Uh, no, not really. Not on the street. Ma'am? You forgot your bike. Ma'am? Ma'am. Ma'am. You want a ticket for that? No, here, take it. Okay. Hey, come here. You guys aren't drinking in the street. Hey, get over here. Now you can give us your name. You want to go to jail? No. You want to go to jail? No. Don't hit me. Don't touch me. You have no, no right to touch me. I just touched you. You have no right to touch me. Now you're going to jail. Do you hear me? Now you're going to jail. Going to jail for what? For what? Oh, now you need me. Stop resisting. Stop resisting right now. Stop right now. Stop resisting. Alright, calm down. Stand you up, okay? Don't kick. Don't punch. That's two. That's two. To what? Stop. Assaults on a PO? You think you're a police officer? F you. You know who I am? What's your fing Zach? You Zach, you fing peg? You fing peg? You're being a fing peg, Zach. You know who Zach is. You know who Zach is, you fing liar. And now you need me and you kick me. Good. You fing deserved it. This is my restaurant. I just was wondering if you knew who she was. No, no, never. Because she was up on your deck. No, we've never around. seen her before. Okay. You know, we used to have, have them sleeping under the tables and stuff. And then I did the partner program. And you guys have always been good keeping an eye on the place. And, you know, we're just running out of places to be. Yeah. Were you here yesterday? No, no. We just, we just happened to be going by. We were on a Wednesday. call around the corner. Yeah. And she pulled around the corner on her bike drinking a beer. Right. Which was a simple solution. Yeah, but she, she could have been it, in and out. She made it difficult. We would just let her go. Are you okay? I saw you fall. No, I'm good. I'm good. Thank you. Yep. Do you have anything on you, ma'am? I, I, I will have a female officer search you. But before I ha have you sit back here, is there anything on you? Why don't you search me? I told you a female officer will search you, but I am not How going to funny. search you right now. Good. Okay. Do you want to sit there or do you want to wait? <laughs> Have a seat in the car here so I can talk to you. 
Alright, what's your name? I don't have a name that matters to you. Yeah, you do. No, I don't! You're lying to me! Why do you think you don't matter? Why do I matter? Just take me to the hospital! Just take me to the hospital and take these off, they're hurting me. You're not supposed to cuff me in the car. What? Because you're not supposed to take them off. Okay. What what's your first name? It's Megan. Okay. Well Megan. You have not been real cooperative. I didn't do anything! Okay. I was drinking That's a beer! Okay. Well, Why can't I drink a beer? Sit down in the car now. 
Megan, stop resisting and sit down in the I car. I want a lawyer. To sit in the car? I want a lawyer to get out of this. I, there's okay. no well, reason to be arrested. Well, you can get one later. Sit in the car, okay? I want a lawyer now. Sit in the car. I want a lawyer now. Sit in Call the car. Call me a f***ing lawyer. Sit Call in the car. Call me a f***ing lawyer. Call me a f***ing lawyer. Yep. Megan. Dispatch, take the 105, take the 104, 10-4. You have one? Yeah. I guess I'm gonna go to the Why won't you sit in the car? I want a lawyer. Okay, when you get to the we jail, you can call yeah, one. We didn't say you could have one. No one's saying you can't have a lawyer. I want a lawyer right now. You well, have no not... right to arrest me. Yes, we do. No, you don't. Okay. No, you don't. All right. I'm pull her no, you don't. Pull that way. Yep. Mm -hmm. Ow! What? Can you grab her? Do you need an arm? Let's go! I'll get it on my f***ing pig! Get in the car! I'm getting it! Don't f***ing touch me anymore, you f***ing pig! Lilith's pig! Lilith's pig! Get this one. Get it! Watch it so it doesn't kick you out. Assaulted me and harassed me. And how did they do that? What are you talking about? I was walking down the street doing absolutely nothing and I get harassed all the time. If you were drinking a beer? So what? Alright, it's legal to drink in the city of Sarasota. It's illegal to drink? Uh huh. And when an officer gives you a lawful command, you have to obey it. I didn't know it was illegal to drink. Yeah. No, I didn't. Hey, you, how long since have you been in Sarasota? Been, since when has it been illegal? Um, I don't know. 23 years, or I've been here 23 and it's been illegal since then. So. What's the point? Because you can't have an alcoholic beverage in the public out here in the open. So, what can you do? Uh, drink in your home or drink in a, a public private area? I don't know. All right, well, I don't know. So, where's your injury at? You said you had some injuries. Not your shit. I've got cuts all over me. Okay. Is that from today? Yeah. Okay. Alright, where are the cuts at? Probably all over my arms. My hands have been cut. Okay, well, you're under arrest, so that's just a normal procedure. They didn't read me my rights. Okay, well, they don't have to read you your rights. Since when? Because they're not questioning you. Do they still need to read me my rights? No, they don't. Since when? I'm not going to get into legalities of things, but they don't have to read your rights unless they're going to question you. I'm only asking you if you were injured or anything due to this arrest. So I'm not, not interrogating you. Okay. All right. Well, we'll document it. All right. But you're going to go to jail. Okay. No. Take me to the hospital. I'm what? psychologically ill. Okay. I schizophrenia. Okay. That's not uh, go to the hospital. There's, sure. there's, there's numerous people who have mental health issues that we don't take to the hospital. Oh, no, you're taking me to the hospital. Okay, well, we're going to roll up the window, and then when you get to the jail, you can talk okay, to the nurse. So okay. Great. okay, all right, have a great day. You too, thanks. Well. Okay, fantastic. Do I need to do anything? To read a person that writes before you arrest them. You had no right to arrest me for drinking a beer. Probably wouldn't even vote you for Yeah, it would not. I didn't fight with anybody. You guys chased after me. I was walking away. I didn't do anything. Looks like you're going to need a look. Once Karen's buzz wore off, she was arrested for resisting arrest without violence and, of course, open container.
tells you want, or you want your phone to stay in the car too. Take it where? To jail. Why are you gonna take me? Because to jail? you resisted arrest after telling me your car was stolen. I told you to get out of the car. Had you have stepped out of the car and obeyed everything I told you to do, none of this I would be happening. Doing nothing wrong, you refused to On a rainy day back in August 7th, 2023. A deputy from the Bernalillo County Sheriff's Office was out and about when he spotted a car zipping past like a rocket in an area where you're only supposed to go 45 miles per hour. So our brave deputy decided it was time for a little chit chat and tried to stop this speed demon. But oh no, the car just hit the gas even more, shooting up to a whopping 90 miles per hour. And who was behind the wheel? None other than our next Karen. Buckle up folks, it's time to get acquainted with her. Hello. Hi. Deputy Go Charlie at the Sheriff's Office. Reason I'm stopping you is careless driving. Do you have your license, registration, and insurance on you? Why are we driving like that? Uh, you're the one that turned around and started, like, coming behind me. Yes, I, I am a cop with lights on and a siren. So yes, I did turn around and drive like that, absolutely. And actually from the other side and I was yep. not driving fast. You were doing 70 when I got you on radar and you sped up to 90 after I turned around, which is ridiculous. Where's the registration? Stop moving, stop Get moving. Off of me. You just Get off of Chill me. Step out. Step out. You just told me the car is stolen. Dude, get out of the car. It's a Stop. joke. So get off of me. Stop. I'm recording you too. Get out of the car. So, what? Separate your feet. Just do it. Hurry up, you piece of shit. You're, he's been hurting me. So what the f do you want me to act like? Yeah. Oh, so sweet. Nicely? Or what? Okay. Well, okay. What do you want me to do? Whisper? Well, you could talk at a normal volume so I could understand what you're trying to say. If I can, you okay. guys have no f***ing concept, idiot. Oh. 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 Put your arm down. Put They're your numb. arm down. I can't even move them. You know that? <laughs> Going to jail. For no reason, right? You're taking me to jail for no reason? <laughs> My son has Lean to be Lean forward. Up. <laughs> Have a seat. Ah. Have a seat. Have a seat. Oh. Hold on, I'm gonna. <sighs> Yeah, I just appreciate it, man. I'm talking to her. First, she's doing 70 on second. She sees me flip around, speeds up to 90. Weaving in and out of people. I stop her here. But. Do you need any additional time? No, we're at 74. Thank you, sir. She's 47? No, so she. 
She's sitting here. I'm talking to her, and I was like, registration. She's like, the car stolen. I was like, get out of the car. What? <laughs> it, it's like you, whether I know it's a no. My dude, my cat's been all jacked up all day. Whether or not she's joking around or not, yeah, like, like who says that? Why would you? Like, yeah, I'm just like committing a felony. And the way she was driving, I was like, I believe it. So, the car could absolutely be stolen. Hey, two or three or so. Can you run the 26 that I had 50 Ford? She advised it was a 27 7. Medical's on the way. What's your last name? Guterres. G U T I E R R E Z. First name? Francesca. F R A N C A T S C A. Date of birth? Okay, Francesca. So, the reason you got pulled out of the car is because you told me it was a stolen car. And I told you to step out, and you refused. So that's why that happened the way it did, okay? Do you understand? Can you take these off of me? I'm hurting! I cannot take the cuffs off when medical gets here. They might need them off to evaluate you, but I can't take them off while you're in my custody. Okay? Can you at least, like, move them down or move, something? Roll, roll your hand. Like, they, they'll come down. This hand just needs to move down. No, but my hands are hurting! Yeah. This car is registered to you? Yeah! So why did you say it was stolen? Because you're being rude right off the bat! Well, that was not a smart decision. Okay! Okay. Alright, Francesca. So you said you need to call your mom to pick up your son? Yeah. Okay. How do I get to call your mom? Was it like a face ID? Little unlock so we can call your mom? Let me see it. Mom, can you go pick Angelo up? Yeah, right now? Yes. Uh, um, what, do I go into that little place? He's gonna be at the gate where they usually let him out. Okay, where well, they usually let him out. What time does he get out of school? He gets out now. I was going to get him and I got pulled over by a cop and got in a fight with him. Because I told him the car was stolen and then he started trying to break my arm. He said that what? Your car was stolen? No, I told him the car was stolen and then he started trying to break my arm like a psychopath. What, what car is stolen? Yours? Yeah. And he starts acting. Mm -hmm. I'll talk to you later. Just go pick Angela up. Alright, alright. Because he's waiting. Alright, right. call, He already called me six times. Okay, bye, bye. And I'm going to turn your phone off so you have battery, okay? You started at 43, yeah? Yeah, I did. Does she have 29s or anything? Let me run so, is there anything out of the car that you want to take with you? No? no? You want everything to stay with the car? Yeah, that's my car. Okay. Alright. I was just making sure, because I'm going to take your phone. So, I was, you want, or do you want your phone to stay in the car too? Take it where? To jail. Why are you going to take me Because to jail? you resisted arrest after telling me your car was stolen. I told you to get out of the car. Had you have stepped out of the car and obeyed everything I told you to do, none of this would be happening. I wasn't doing nothing wrong, You refused though. to... So, let me explain this to you. I was pulling you over for speeding. Okay? I walk up and talk to you. I explain I know, to you why I pulled you I over. I but I wasn't doing nothing wrong. Spe speeding is wrong. It's against the law. Oh. 
Well, well, can't you just give me like a ticket or something? Absolutely, I could have had you have not told me your car was stolen and then tried to fight me and not get out of the car. Yeah, because I was trying to bend over while you were trying to bend I told my you to arm. unclip your seatbelt and you refused and you were trying to get in your glove box. I wasn't doing that at the same time. I was, you. So, but it is what it is. Okay. It's over. But now I have to do, there's nothing, I have no choice. Okay? I can talk to my supervisor and see if he's okay with me issuing a summons, but that's going to be up to him. Okay? Because you do have a kid, so I can probably try to work with that, but I need to talk with him and figure that out, okay? Does that make sense? Well, can you please? I, I'm going to talk to him, but medical is here, so I'm going to let you talk with them, okay? Go ahead and walk around the back. Come on. Come around this side. Back on oh. there. They, they tried to evaluate you earlier and you denied them. I didn't deny them. What I was pretty I, much in shock. My okay. arms were numb. Would you like me to have them meet us over there? For what? They're not going to do nothing anyway. Okay. So it's just a, a yes? Of, it's just a yes or no question? It's a waste question. of time, pretty okay. much, what, so they can answer me. Ask me if... This hurts or that hurts when I'm telling you the same thing. Yeah, my hands are numb. My back is hurting. Yes. Mm -hmm. These headphones. Is there anything else in your pockets? Okay. Okay. I'm just making sure so we'll get these in there with you at the jail too, okay? So you're taking me to jail? Ma'am, ma I have no other choice. Had you have not done all of that, it would have been a simple ticket and you would have been on your way. <laughs> really? To, to jail is unnecessary. The only reason you have to go to jail is the resisting arrest charge. That's the only reason you have to go to jail. On the careless, you would have gotten a ticket and you'd have been on your way. You want some really? air? Do you want me to roll down the window or turn on the air back here? Yes, if you can at least roll the window down. Yeah. I'll roll the window down for you. Where it goes. Alright, ma'am. Come on out. Okay, so as to everyone, nothing in your bra that you want to take in there. Karen got slapped with charges for reckless driving and obstructing a police officer. As she awaits her day in court, fingers crossed she's picked up a valuable lesson, never to jest about her car being swiped again. Law enforcement quickly responded on September 19, 2023, when a domestic dispute turned physical. The incident occurred when the girlfriend made an unanticipated visit to her boyfriend's job site while he was immersed in a home renovation project. Their verbal disagreement escalated into a physical altercation, necessitating immediate police intervention. Here's what happened when the police arrived. What happened after that? And then I left. You just left? Yeah, she went to my house. I live on the other street. So how did you get here? Um, my friend Leslie brought me from my mom's house because I was at my mom's what house. What kind of car was it? Uh, a black Mustang. A black Mustang. Okay. But she's not. Did she did she, she just let brought me see? off. So she didn't. See she nothing. didn't see anything because it was actually in that little room, so you couldn't see anything yeah. where he where he actually did it. So you just came here, confronting them about cheating. Yeah, that was about it. He and grabbed, he you by grabbed the me neck. by the neck, and 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 I did bit him to let him for him to let me go. I did do that. Let's see your teeth. 
Okay. And then you just left after that? Yeah, I just left. And I got Did to you him. say anything to him when you nope. came up to him? You just confirmed him? Yep. That's all I told him. I was like, you, you're just a liar. That's exactly what I said to him. Okay. Do you know who lives at the house where he's at? Um, Richard. Okay. An old man. Did you know he was going to be here today? Um, yeah, he had told me, but I didn't know he was going to be driving the, um, his little bitch on um, the car. How did he say he was going to get here? Um, Uber. Uber? Well, that's what he told you? Yeah. When did he tell you that? This morning? In the morning, because he, he went in the room and he told me to ask his dad to come. If he can come um, drop me off with my kids to school, drop them off at school, and to drop me off at my mom's house. Okay. Because that bitch was still there. When he grabbed you, how did he grab you around the neck? He just grabbed me like this. Just with one hand? Yeah. With his nails, that's how yeah. he got? So he never grabbed around your neck at all? No, like, he grabbed me like this. Did you lose, um, were um, you able to breathe? Yeah, I was breathing, okay. but he grabbed me. That's why I have those scratches here. Okay. So he didn't help you, hold you down against your no. will? Okay. So he just grabbed you like a claw mark? Mm -hmm. okay. And that's where I bit him on the cheek. Right here where he has bruise right here. I wish I would have punched him, but it would literally be a punch. When, another question, when you confirmed him, he turned, was he on the ladder? Yeah, he got off the ladder though. Were you saying anything to him before you got on the ladder? Yeah, that's why I told, I, I actually scared him because he didn't know I was coming. Because I don't have a phone. Okay. okay. And when you initially scared him, what did you say to him? I was like, yeah, you f***ing liar. That's what I said. And that's when he got off the yeah. ladder? And that's when he came around and grabbed you by yep. the net? Okay. You, are you able to run, provide a sworn written statement what happened? Oh, yeah. Okay, I'll be right back. I gotta wait real quick. The other officer has my clipboard with the thumb statements, okay? Can I see your hands? Uh, how long were you guys together for? 12 years. 12 years? Okay. How many kids do you guys I have? I have three kids with him, oh. unfortunately. You guys are never married, though? No. Okay. Unfortunately, I just had my, my daughter. She's only a So, mother. unfortunately, this is domestic. Do you guys have kids in common? You guys have been together for that long, living in the same household. Okay. So, there is going to be a report taken and pending our investigation, what's going to occur, okay? I already had a report on him with the sheriff's department. Has he been arrested for it? No, he didn't. I didn't want him to get arrested for it. Because it, was was it wasn't the first time um, I got hit. And I got hit when I was pregnant, actually, of his daughter. How many times does he physically hit you? A lot? The, this, is the, this is the second time that I actually... Well, he called the cops because I didn't call the cops on him. Yeah. So, the first time I did call the cops, well, my mom did. Okay. And they took me in the, um, the, the they took me to the hospital uh, to get checked because I was pregnant. And I didn't, I didn't want, I didn't well, want them to take him to jail. And like he has hit me like five times, but this is the second time with the cops. Hello, sir. So just walk me right through exactly what transpired. Just walk through it again. Um. Well, this morning I came to work. Yeah. Um, I didn't. I don't have a vehicle. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I asked for uh, that vehicle. Um, everything is fine uh, until. Uh, probably about an hour before I made a call, um, that she found out that it was uh, this girl's car. Does she have a phone? Does your does your girlfriend have a phone? Uh, not a right, not right now. She okay. she does have a um a Wi-Fi phone, I guess. How did she know you were here? I I told mm -hmm. her uh, everything. Everything was fine. Uh, you know, she knows I'm working. She. So let me ask you this: You guys fought. You guys have been arguing recently, right? I'm arguing, yes. Okay. When did she get these scratches? Because I know it's not from today. What scratches? She, she got like scratches like this on her neck. But I know they're not from today because they're they're scabbing. So unless she's like one of the X-Men, there's no way she heals that quickly. You know what I'm saying? Right, right. So that's previous, which probably is not in our jurisdiction because you guys live in county jurisdiction or human tillers. But... Um, you know, she's also claiming that there's also fresh injuries in the mix of those bad injuries, or the old injuries. So, um, when you grabbed her to get her off, you where exactly on her body did you grab her? Um, 
I just push her away like this. Like, but like how? From the front? From the back? From the front. So like from the front of the throat? Like with one hand, two hand, like this? How'd you do it? No, with both hands. Because she was punching me. Kind of like this? Or did you grab her by the neck? No, no, like push her. So like you just pushed her right here from the front? Like get yes. off of me? Okay. You never grabbed her neck or anything like no. that? Three two four zero seven zero zero five four three zero. Fresh four three one. Isabella, right here. Is there fresh paint right here? Yes, it is. It's fresh paint well, right there. Probably by now. It's just, Was it it's fresh? Uh -huh. Yes. How long ago did you paint that? Um, like 10, 15 minutes before I made a call. Okay. Um, I was. Like so you were you were painting in the process when she came here. Fifty-five twenty-eight. Okay. Um, and like I said, I was on top of the ladder, uh, facing that way. And she's a Lima Mike Hotel. Okay, and then X -ray after that, L M H. She came in here, confronted you. Beyond a white right. Toyota. Um, and you got down. What did she? So far, what did she, she say she was going out? Uh, she said, "I'm going to get you out of the car." She kind of like. Uh, mm -hmm. What did she do? She punch you, bite you, kick you? No, but whenever I got down, that's she start punching me. Start punching you? Yeah. Okay. Well, first it was just. I think it was just her slap. Yeah. And then she got more upset. She just called back and she was overheating, so I put her through the EMS Okay. And then after that, she just left. No. Um, did when she punched you? Did you like? Then you just pushed her off. Yeah. Where'd she land when you pushed her? Like, where'd she get pushed uh, she, back she was, to? We were just standing right here. Just like um, yeah. So you just, like, slightly pushed her and did she move at all? No. No? You just tried to get her off you because you were punching. Yeah. And then she just walked out? No. She ran? No, no, no. no. Um, I, I tried to, um, I said, all right, well, then, uh, you know, I'm working with um, you. Know, that you the I, I explained to her that the gentleman right here can tell her that I've been here the whole time, that nobody's mm -hmm. been here. And um, I open the door to try to uh, get Richard, get Mr. Richard, but he's uh, he's really tired. So he didn't come outside and she was inside, uh, you know, still screaming. So she was but, screaming at you or Richard? No, me. Inside the residence? Yeah. Then she, what happened after that? And then um, I just, I didn't know what else to do. Um, so I call my mom. Uh, the reason why I call my mom is because she really does um, uh, care care for my mom. What she she would say. And um, did all, she talk to your mom at all? Yes. Okay. Yes. Um, and all my mom was saying, all my mom told her was um, that uh, to please just let me finish doing what I was working. Um, she told her that um, what was she doing here if. She was, she's supposed to be taking care of her kids while I'm doing my, my work. Your job, yeah. And um, to, to just leave and then whenever she gets off of work, uh, she will go pick her up and then that way uh, we, yes, can, separate. we can uh, uh, talk and, you know, come to So a, once she got off the phone with your mom, she left? Yes, sir. Did she say anything to you after that? Uh, no, she just slammed the door and then she left. Okay, let me see this. If you were to ask... Nine out of ten people on the street, right? Hey, listen, she has old marks that are scabbing and and fresh, right? Like they just been either picked or scratched, okay? Then you see his injury, okay? I did bit him. No, I, I get that. Here's the thing is, in the state of Florida, we have an obligation to separate parties, to, to arrest the primary aggressor, mm -hmm. right? I'm not saying by any means what you did was, you know, wrong, okay? But what I'm saying is, is that the fact that you came here basically to argue is instigating the, the fight, mm -hmm. okay? That being the primary aggressor. Okay. In the court's eyes... But I don't want him to grab my kids. Okay. Well, you know, oh. Yeah, I don't want him near my kids because okay. he does okay. drugs. Where are your kids at? With my grandma. Okay. Here's, um... You have grandma? That's my house, she's at my house. Okay, yeah. yeah. How many kids do you have? I have three. Okay. Here, listen, so you guys stay together? Yeah, fortunately I live with him. Alright. Here's my next thing. Okay. 
Um, it, because it's domestic, you can't go near people. Okay. So I can't go get my stuff. No, yes, you can, oh. but you're gonna have to call. You're gonna have to call either the county or whoever jurisdiction that is to get your stuff. You technically have to do it the right way. Don't go in yes, because, by yourself. Yes, because here's the thing: is if you go in there by yourself. You can easily call the cops, and you're going to be rearrested for a violation of the free trial, uh, free trial, and then they're going to no bond. Get ready to blow. It's more than likely will be a hundred dollars or a thousand dollars, which to a bondsman is a hundred dollars. Okay. Once you hit a hundred dollars, you're out, and then they'll give you obviously either a court date or public defender or whatever. Okay. Make sure that they have an updated address, which would more than likely be theirs. So. Any paperwork that you need or getting, he's not getting access to, and basically you miss a court date or anything like that. Okay? Do you need anything with you? Do you have anything home? that you have? Mm -hmm. At the house? At your house? No, in the Oh. Do you have numbers to call someone? There you go. I don't know my mom. Do okay. you want to write their numbers down just in case? No, need to do it. Do you have a piece of paper? 10 4. But as of right now, if you know he's doing drugs, listen, I know it's not, it's a hassle. DC has the way to go. Because they can easily start making their way in there, and they won't, as in, like, let's say he does fight for custody, it's denied because he has this DCF that was proved to be correct or that he's using. Like, here, if we know this is a narcotics house and he's continually running here, that's not a good look, right? We, you can, you can even say the cops walk in and there's syringes on the ground. And it ain't for medicine. You know what I'm saying? We know what those syringes are. I know what drug he does. He does crack. Okay. Well, I would have got it. This whole block, basically. So, um, just, this is, a, this is a speed bump. And quite honestly, this might be the best speed bump to get. I'm just talking straight, all right? It sucks that you're going to have to go, but it's a speed bump because it solidifies it, right? There ain't no coming back now. I'll tell you what, you get back with him, that's your choice. But, but this should solidify it, right? Can you, um, is that Hey, bro. Don't even go. Thank you. You're so sorry. Don't even get near Stay over there. Stay over there. Don't over there. even Go. get near me. Go. More documentation. But when you don't call, right? Even if it's an argument, right? No one goes to jail for arguing. But it lets us know that, hey, these people are having issues. So now when we're coming out to your house three times, four times a week, and then next thing you know... Unsurprisingly, the Karen girlfriend encountered legal issues and was formally accused of battery, resulting in her being taken to Lake County Jail. Nevertheless, she was freed a mere day afterwards due to a bond of $11,000. On October 30th, 2023, Karen reached a plea agreement, allowing her to escape imprisonment. On February 25th, 2021, police officers were running license plates of vehicles exiting a high-crime neighborhood. However, when they ran the plates of our next Karen's vehicle, they discovered that she had a probation violation and a warrant for her arrest and pulled her over. However, what happened next could not have been anticipated. It's not in me, it's just in my pants. Like, right on the underwear line? Like, right here in my door. Let us see if we have a female officer available. I'd feel more comfortable with a female officer, okay? Can you get it out by any chance, or? Yes. It's okay, baby. Hi, buddy. How are you? Is your boy? Yeah, he'll be six tomorrow. Six? Cool. Thank you. So where are you headed? I'm going to my mom's. Where, where's mom at? I'm um, going out. Okay. Can I talk to you back here for a little bit, yeah. please? Okay, so... Here's what's happening. When you came out of the Imperial Sky, we were checking bin, uh, plates because we could get a lot of stolen vehicles. Okay. When we ran your plate, it came back that the registered owner has a probation violation. So there's a warrant out for you. Um, that's why I asked you for your name because they asked. They said it was uh, a Donica um, okay. Barella. Yeah, from there. So you do have a, uh, it's a probation violation, right? That we have to serve. You know what? You know why you got violated or anything? 
But now we have the issue of your little boy being in the car here, so we need to find out. Can I get? If maybe your mom could come Bye. get him or. Doing, Pick up your, your mask. Can right I here. get my son to my mom? Do it. Do, is there any way she could come out here? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Do you want to call her? Can you guys figure out my important issue? I don't. I don't know who you would call. I thought my probation was finished. Let me confirm. So if you want to just hang out right here, call mom and just let her know what's going on, and I'll confirm see if the if it's if it's in there, okay? Maybe I go here. Oh, she got a cue with her? Mom's on her way. Nice. What's she doing over there? She's up there. She says she's using the fruit there right now. Oh, I know. What's up, buddy? You all right? Yes. All right. Dallas. You forget to check in or what? No, I, I thought it was over. Did you get a letter from the state? I have it in my mom. It's valid. You still have it. Where's your mom coming from? She got mom coming? I can go. I don't have a case. I can go pick it up real quick. Yeah. You know? So. Yeah, we'll wait till mom gets here and takes, takes that little boy. Hey, when you're 98 there, can you 87 with me here at uh, Valley and Isaacs? I'm going to have a 15. I can go uh, pick up the work. I don't have a cage. Fly. That thing. Yeah, but I, can go, I want to go pick up the work. He'll come after he's 98. Hi, right, buddy. Oh, it's your birthday tomorrow? Gonna get some sun? How old are you gonna be? Six? You are big for six. Who is this over here in this gray Mustang? Over here. Oh, I have no idea. That's why I don't know how long it's He just pulled off. You know exactly where you came from, gotta make sure you really, really happy. You know that place. You know, and Rube, you said his name? Actually, that's my second time, but yeah. So, all these people here, like I said, not a good spot for a cute kid like this. Under the warrant, is it just other authorities? Misdemeanor or felony? I think it's just a misdemeanor. Okay. I don't know, what is it? It might be a felony. So, it's a, it's a probation violation, but I don't know what she's on probation for. Violation of a court order statewide. You got the warrant number. It has to be a felony, right? Can I get that warrant number, bro? Uh, William 902 uh -huh. 871 165. That's the magistrate? Uh, yeah, I don't. Let's call her over here. And it's reminding you. Miss Varela. What was your uh, what was your initial charges when you got on probation? Um, just the probation. But what what did you get charged with? Theft. Theft. Yeah. Uh, what was the amount? Eight hundred. Okay. Was you, were you charged felony? Yeah. Okay. So that's the that did you end up doing any kind of jail time or? Yeah, I went to jail. Um, but then uh, I remember going to court and getting on probation and um, my attorney discussing it with the judge about how long and so forth. I, I really don't recall. It's been a while, but. Okay. But it was for theft. That was it? Yeah. No other charges? No. Okay. All right. Just same title, okay? You said your mom's going to come though? Yeah. Can you get me a question in the ocean? Or can you? I'll get a breather. Do you know if anybody can come pick your car up? Uh, I, just, I don't, I don't want to have to tow it. Yeah. Uh, you're okay with that? Yeah. Hey buddy, you ready to go up there? Just hang tight, we'll let, we'll let you know. Once the officer says it's okay. Come on, baby. 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 You okay with that or no? Or should we tow it? Ah.
Them in there? No. You want to take your cash with you? Uh, what is it going to be? Behind your books. Oh. I'll touch you. So what's today? Thursday? You may be out tomorrow. You can be out fast. Straight. Hey, what were you doing there? Um. Be I'll, real. Because we're going to do you a favor of not towing your car, but. I went to um, actually get gasoline, the eight dollars that we got. Um, he was supposed to give me ten dollars. Um, uh, this car? That's my car. I went to get his gas money. Um, the owner of the apartments? I guess I don't really know him like that. Um, it's a friend's friend. And you say he's gonna give you some money? Ride, yeah, when I went to go give my friend a ride yesterday, I believe, or the day before, um. He was supposed to give me $10 for that, but he never did, and so that's what I went for. Come here. You want to give this to your mom? Yeah. Is that what you're there doing or not? No. Because we're going to search the car. Is there dope in here or not? No. No, there's not. Did you use in there and then you took off or what? No. Then what were you doing there? I went to where you asked me. I'm not using it. I didn't even realize I was going to be honest with that. Or I would have said, yeah. Well, apparently you're still using it. That's still in your wallet, right? I mean, honestly, why would you have that in there if you're not using it? I'm trying to help you. I didn't know I was going to be honest with that. You're using, you got your little boy. Hey, that's what no. pisses me off. That's your little boy over there. That's bullshit. You can't do that. You gotta get your sh together. It's not that hard. You just gotta not use. Everything else will work. What did they tell you? You gotta kill your number on probation and then that's it, it's off your record? So then? I just thought I was older with her. How old are you? Okay, you know, that's when it's, they issued the warrant. How old are you? I'll be 29 on the second. 29? I'm sorry, I'm sorry to get an old. You gotta get together. You have to. You live with your mom or what? You can't take your little boy over there. No more. We're at that place all the time. I do not want to see you at that. On that strip of the street, ever again. There's no reason for to have to visit anybody over there, ever. Nobody good hangs out on West Picacho. I just need a gas in the Give me more time for my You gotta eat a piece of humble pie. You cannot be over there. This car is too easy for me to remember. And I really don't mind if it's just you, but what bothers me is that you took a little kid over there, a six-year-old. You can't do that. And I know you didn't get down on the car with him because you came back and got in the car by yourself. So you left a six-year-old unattended in the part of town. Who's your boyfriend? Really? You know, you know a guy named Mark Escobar? Uh, it's not for you, really. You have any idea where 
where he's at. You said you haven't been with him for a year? Almost half a year. Half a year? Almost. Ain't nothing on Facebook when we look right now. No. I haven't done it yet. You still in town? I have no idea. I haven't talked to him. How long has this been going? Mom says it's been going for a long time. Um, my addiction, uh, I started years About half a year ago? Years ago, and uh, I'm just now like getting off and just starting to go around the wrong side of I know. You know it too? You got a very good liar. I'm just saying that right now. Okay. I really don't know what I'm talking about. This doesn't matter, but where you're at, where you're hanging out with, the fact that you have your son there, that kind of stuff, I mean, it's, I can lecture all you want, but it's up to you to make the, you know, the choices. If not, you'll be running into us a lot. Ask that entire crew. They know exactly who we are. Nothing to people inside the car, you said? Who's coming to get it? My husband. Huh? My mom's husband. You want me to go pick up the 40? Uh, let's find out where the transport's at. Yeah, right. Last one, tell one to ask. Hey, Kat, I have this female here with 738. Uh, I'm just trying to be efficient. Is it cool if I just take her and leave her with you, and then I'll let Juan take you to paperwork? Yeah, that would help out, sir. All right, cool. I'll 87 there with you here in just a second. Hey, let's go, all right? You want to drink the rest of that water or no? I'm just letting you know right now, it's not a threat. I'm just telling you right now, they have an x-ray machine at the jail. They're going to x-ray you. They're going to go through your pockets, everything like that at all. Is there anything you need to tell us right now before that comes down? That's going to be an additional charge. Yeah. Okay, where is it? My pants. Okay. Where are your pants? Inside my pants. Inside? Yeah. Your pockets or inside your pants? Inside my pants. Do you want it? Well, the problem is we don't have, we're, we're male officers, you're a female, okay? We can have you be going to, we can get a female officer over here, so that we've been reporting this entire time, too. Well, I can just turn around and get it. No, like I said, we have a female officer come over here right now, so. It's not in me, it's just in my pants. Like, right on the underwear line? Like, right here in my door. Let us see if we have a female officer available. I feel more comfortable with a female officer, okay? Call 868, over. My radio's dead. I got it. My radio's dead, bro. I don't know what happened. Use that one, Sarge. It's gonna be... Yeah. Oh, look, mine's dead, too. This thing on? You lying, bro. <laughs> Second-hand information... You gonna charge this many, or you want metro? Information from the brother... You want me to call? Uh, that people are starting uh, small fires in the backyard. We'll just enter it, dude, and let Metro follow up. It's going to be a Daniel Alberete. Lives at this location. Also stating that Thank subjects you. are spotting as well. Wait, it's don't... Process three of code 16 uses. Just letting you know, too, because you just thought... She has to open her, okay? Yeah, okay, oh. All right. Sir. Complaint is requesting. Here you go, Josh. I can get you a couple of chargers. We'll put them in your car. And, uh. She's busy, dude. 914. Yeah, we need an evidence bag. Um, no. I'll just, uh. I'll have one call Metro. Have one call Metro give you the 20 bucks. Tell them that we have a female with the user amount of dope on her. You guys know what it is? Uh, no. Do you have an evidence bag? God. This can ever have evidence? Okay. So she's got a user amount of dope on her. She's gonna pull it. We'll have it. We'll have her uh, secured inside a glove or something. Okay. Just enter the dope and tell On Call Metro that here's the case number. The dope is entered under this case number and she's in jail on a probation violation. Everything you need is there. If you want to charge her later, fine. If you want to come talk to her, she's at the jail. Okay. But, I mean, it's not her unless you want to sit with her at the station. Okay.
Hold on. So you're gonna have to get it at the jail? They're fentanyl pills? Alright. Okay. Anything else? Alright, turn around. Oh, gloves, dude. I need more gloves. They're fentanyl pills, dude. Metro's gonna have to come out. Hey Juan, they're fentanyl pills. Metro's gotta come out. Just tell them to meet you at the station. Okay. Metro to the station. All right, come on. I'm gonna go to the back of my car. You got the dope, right? Yep. I'll take her to the station, dude. I'll meet you there then. We did not ask her. We want to. Hey, stupid. Where are the keys? I'm gonna have some. Okay, she took them with her. Hey, mom took the keys with her. So Jack, she had to go get boyfriend from back. Mom took the keys, right? Yeah. Hey, Manny, can I have my old radio battery back? Yeah. Hey, Maddie, do you have it with you or no? As you just witnessed, Karen was arrested on her outstanding warrant. However, based on her actions today, she picked up a new set of charges. During the early hours of November 1st, 2022, in Flagler County, Florida, dispatch received a call about a woman who had driven off the road and nearly into the ocean. What makes this story more intriguing is that the caller was no stranger to the Karen driver who crashed her vehicle, and you're about to witness how the story played out. My friend Jesus was driving when we ended up here. Sorry, you said Jesus? Yes. Like Jesus take or the wheel? He was a stupid. He did though. Tell me I'm lying. Tell me right now I'm lying, Jess. Your dad is Dave Blank. Tell me I'm lying. Her best friend was driving. His name is... Jesus. So. Hey guys. Hey sir, how are you? We have deputies here. Can I hang? Hang with you. Alright. Alright. Take care. Is that our dispatch you're talking yes. to? Okay. Yes. So, I'm a silver. I will, me and the other girl are silver. Um, we came from Razzles and her cousin was with her. Okay. Um, she was intoxicated. We took her keys uh -huh. and all that. We took her to her job and gave the keys to her coworkers who they said would drive Where's her. Where's her job at? She went to Johnny D's. Johnny D's? Yep. So um, we left, my friend and I left to go home. Um, and when we went home, at some point, we got a call. So I guess at some point her coworkers gave her the keys. Um, they're like, she's like, I'm stuck, she's crying. Uh -huh. We put up her you location. Before further, where's the car? Where is she? What, what, Are they me? injured? I, no, she's not injured, she's crying. So, and my friend's where, with her. Where is she? Do you want to go, if I can go on the car, I'll take I don't have you. a cage, so we no. can follow okay, you. Okay. Okay. It's going to be a little walk. Where is it? Um, down that path, by the water. Alright, I'm gonna back my car soon so y'all can see this. Alright, alright. Oh. 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 O
Hi. Is anybody hurt? No. No, we're not hurt. We're just Alyssa? Stuck. Yes. Okay. Alyssa, yes. Don't so we'll leave us. Just we'll sit in the car. We're, no, we're literally stuck and I cannot get out. Okay, okay, hold on a second. I have a dog, I'm sorry. Stay there, shut the car off. Shut the car off. I try. Hey. How is that work? Oh, it's a bunch more calls, huh? That's a who the f you drive, Sam? Echo Uniform Juliet, Papa 8-2, EUJ, P-8-2 on a white Kia. Just stay. Grab those. What? Grab those. Sure. What's up? You okay? Hello. I'm good. Morgan, I know I'm... you. I went to high school with you. I don't know. Yes. You know. No, we literally... My car, I was at Wawa, I was parked out there all night work at Johnny D's, and someone let us drive, and yeah. That's okay. my niece. We ended up Who all was in the car when this thing got stuck? Too. And why no, was it back here? my car is over there. Why was it back here? Because we ended up at Wawa. Okay. I was trying to get her to her car, that's my niece. Okay. Yeah. But why is it back here? You have no idea. We have. I was driving. We have no idea. We were at Johnny V's. At work at Johnny V's. I don't know. Okay. My friend Jesus was driving. We ended up here. Sorry, you said Jesus. Yes. Like Jesus take or the wheel. He was a stupid. <laughs> he did though. Tell me I'm lying. Tell me right now I'm lying, Jess. Your dad is Dave Blank. Tell me I'm lying. Her best friend was driving. His name is. Jesus, he was dressed as Jesus, and we ended up here. Her mom here? is on the way, and we're lit. What's up, Joe? Are either you guys injured? No, no we're good. Oh, my car, sure? This is my brand new I car. I'm just like her. sags. I don't know what the on my car. Okay. I never go out. I ended up in Daytona. I was like, I'm lit. We just, we just want to make sure that you guys aren't injured. No, we're good. Okay. Jess is uh, supposed to be here. That's my mom in law, my other mom. Me. Hmm? Melissa, if y'all know Melissa, that's my uh, mom. They're back down at the end of the trip. Yeah, my little You're gonna save us when we called you. What? <laughs> you better air in no mood to be I'm laughing right now. Don't I'm touch just, me. I'm not. Don't I'm sorry. even try I'm that. So I'm, sorry. I'm glad you think this is funny because not, I'm not laughing. No, it's not funny, but Melissa and Jess, they should be calling me because they're the ones that, like, they know what's going on. I don't think they do, and I don't think you do either. So call them. My mom is Melissa, her mom is Jess. Oh, I know her mom. Call them. Yeah. Her mom is my best friend. Okay. My mom's best friend. Mm -hmm. Call it. This is Joel Levo. He's fine. Good that, that's friend. cool. That's fine. That's fine. You guys need them? Are you hurt? No. We're not hurt, but I want my mom and everybody else to give me her car and stuff. Whoever oh, drives me home, I want to get me home. That's my car. I want to get home. So the key's still in your car is your car turned off. It's in my purse, in the white purse. Okay. Is your ID in there and everything too? That's all in there. Okay. You might Nothing go illegal. Ahead and turn go off ahead. the car, pull the keys. It's all in there. Nothing illegal. I think they shut it off when we got here. Okay, cool. Yeah. So, um, we gotta okay. shut it off. I don't go to my shoes. I want to get home. Where my mom at? Your mom at? I don't know. So you're saying that she was driving? Oh, you guys got a puppy in here. Yeah, yeah, my puppy. Where's your car? No, I was not driving here. What? Mine's I was not Toyota. driving here. I work at Johnny D's. Yeah. Okay. So how'd you get here, here from you. Razzles then? No, I was working at Johnny D's. She was at Razzles. How'd you get from Johnny D's to here then? Um, my friend Ashley works there. She drove me. She drove to Wawa. Me. Why is all your friends saying Wawa. you were driving? I did from Wawa. You did from Wawa. So you I were driving the night. vehicle, correct? Yeah, I worked there at Wawa. How much did you, you know what? We had two shots of tequila. Before we left, I had two shots of tequila. Okay. Uh, what's your name? Uh, listen to me real quick, okay? You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say may be used as evidence against you. Against you, yeah. you have the right to talk to an attorney and have him here with you yes, now or any time during questioning. Know. Let me finish. If you cannot afford an attorney, one will be appointed to represent you. Yes, sir. If at any time you wish to stop talking or have an attorney present, all questioning will be stopped at your request. Do you understand yes, these rights? sir, but I don't have no reason to get arrested because I wasn't right, well, driving I'm, I'm not saying. I'm just reading you this. Uh, Do you understand these rights? Yeah, I right. love the police. Of okay, course. so 
Do you understand these rights? Of course. That's a yes, okay? With these in mind, do you want to talk to me? Or talk to him, talk to any one of us? Okay, I'd perfect. Love to. I love the police. That's my niece. I'm making sure she get home straight. I'll follow her. Hang on a second. Hold, hold on, hold on, hold on. Come here, Sam. Okay. 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 Sam, come over here and talk to me. Sam, talk to uh, Deputy. Yeah, what's up? All right. That's my niece. All right, so. Me. You, don't, you don't need her here. You, you yeah. go talk to him. Uh, right? Let go for a minute. No, no, I'm not going to no. I don't go. You're not going with Sam. Ma'am, if you don't mind letting go of her, I'm going to talk to her over I there. I will. That's my Lisa, dog. Can you take the I dog? That. That's my family. That's my niece. I'm, I'm going to grab boots. I'm going to nope. talk to your niece nope. with the dog so that she's That's able fine. to take care of the dog. That's okay? fine. No, we're good. All right. We're good. I'll take my dog. No, ma'am. No, 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 That's you my need, dog. No. Nope. To to no. So, you were driving? I was not driving. No, you were not. I was not driving. I was at Wawa the last time I was in my car. Sam, you got to let go. I'm not letting go. him. He will take care of That's fine. That's my family. You're my family. I'm not letting go. I'm not putting That was car my car. I was not driving, no. We The last time I was at Wawa is the last time I was in my car. Okay. And, and you can ask her. Here? You can ask her, right? Right? Sam, I'm not lying to him. You're right? She I wasn't was lying. You're right? She was driving? I was at, I was at Wawa, Sam, I right? I can't lie to them. I wasn't lying. Was I at Wawa or what? I don't know where Did I drive from Wawa or what? I don't know. So did I drive from Wawa or what? Sam, I don't know where right you were. So say it right now. Did I drive from Wawa or what? Sam, here's the deal. Is Dave Blankenship your dad or what? Dave is my so dad. Did you, so I'm did I drive from Wawa or yes, what? Yes, you were driving. I were don't you know here? where the hell you were. were. You here? No, I was at my okay, house. Okay, so she right, doesn't you know. know. Okay, okay, so she well, wasn't I think here. she does know. Okay. She wasn't here, though. Right. She wasn't here. That was my niece. I drove her from Daytona. Mm -hmm. So she's cool? She's and cool. I'm good. Not yet. So call my mom. So what about her dad? Because he's in the... I'm 24. Okay, I don't need to call your mom. So I drove her home. So you did drive? Yeah, no, not my car. We drove her car. Okay, who drove your car then? A 2022 what? Sonata, what? Elantra, what? Okay. It was a Hyundai. I didn't drive my car from Wawa. I parked my car at Wawa. Okay, you told me before that you did drive. I did, from Wawa. Okay, now you not just Not my car. Didn't. I did not drive my car. But then who did? I put it on, God on, I swear to God, I put it on my car. Uh -huh. Called my mom, Melissa Vale. Why were you Vail. sitting behind the driver's seat? Put it on my mom, Melissa Vale. Uh -huh. I didn't just get out of the passenger side. No, you climbed over from the driver's side. I didn't put on my passenger side, so you, call my mom. You climbed out so of the So call my mom. Side. She's Dave's okay, best friend. Call her. Right. Call him. Call him. So, I'm, not, I'm not trying to not. I promise you, I'm not trying to not. But I promise you, call my mom. Okay, hold on one That's just best Are you friend. you the, the driver's side? So tell him. I was driving. You have proof? I was driving. I saw you behind the driver's seat. Oh, yeah? Mm -hmm. Because I just got on the passenger side. And your passenger. Because I just got on the passenger side. Um, Call Dave. Told me she Call Dave. Call Dave. She's not gonna lie. Call Dave. Uh, Call Dave. Give me my phone. Exactly. I'm not lying. Actually, she'll tell me the truth. She's best friends with Dave. Wait, Dave, 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 Dave,
Yeah. Okay. Throw some right. down there and try to let him go to the bathroom. Yeah. Um, so, just give me a second. So, right, so she was the only one driving when you got here? So, she called you? Mm-hmm. And said so she wrecked up? Yeah, but she was like, I'm stuck. And I was like, all right, I'm coming. Yeah, no, no. Come check your car. It's okay, dude. I was like, I'm leaving. You said, my car. I should get a little slower. Okay, just don't go too far. I just want to, uh, I'm right here. I'm just going to ride over to Talatide. I'm going to ride a 27 over to Talatide. And then, if you want a discussion. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. I'm gonna run this over I'm so ready to go to bed. I got work at 7.30 in the morning. Follow him. Follow him. I was gonna drive on drunk, please. Drive me. Oh, I have Alyssa's phone. Where's Alyssa? Phone. Alyyssa? Alyssa. That should be fine. I'm, I'm gonna get on this before I go. I'll take you, bitch. 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 i will find an ID for that one? Did you guys find an ID when you got the dog or is it still in the car? The purse, is it still in the car? It's still, it's still in the car? Okay. I have, bitch. I lift up. Yeah, bitch. Go ahead, Jay, bitch. Bitch. I'll be dying now, bitch. Put in the car. Here, put your foot in, in the car. Keep me in here, but please. I gotta, keep I gotta ask you a couple questions, all right? That's fine. Are you willing to participate in field sobriety exercises? That's fine. Okay, please. you will. Yeah, but I didn't drive. That's fine, I will. Okay. Well, we're gonna move you somewhere over there where it's a little bit more flat. That's okay? fine, but I didn't drive here. I hope you know that. Alyssa, right there, she drove me home from Daytona. Okay. I hope you know that. Dave Blake, she drove me home. Her daughter. His daughter. And my, my mom knows that, Melissa. She's right here. So you're willing to do the FSEs? Yes, I am, right. but I did not drive. Okay, we're just going so to do So do you know okay. that? All right. That's we're my over, friend. Over there, That's okay. my friend from high school. Watch do you know foot. that, though? Watch your leg. Watch no, your my face. Side. But Hang do you on. know that? She's driving you over but there, But do you okay? know that? What is she doing? But before I do the sobriety, do you all know that? Do we know what? I did not drive here. Okay. We're past that, okay? No, I'm asking. Put your leg you, in the car. No, I'm asking. Do you know that? Because Dave Blankenship, no, his daughter right there, Alyssa, drove me home. Slide that back in the car, please. Okay, here. We're not going to play games. Yeah, are you ready? Yes, I remember. I did, I did not drive my car tonight. I swear to God. Go face the car on everything me. I love. Yeah. Please, I did not drive my car tonight. Kia K5 2021. I did not drive my car. I can't believe any Please. Can I take this off, put this on top of yeah, your head, okay? I did not drive my car from Johnny B's tonight. Oh, I work at here. Johnny B's. Sam, come over here. Come over here. Just, I'm gonna use this left line right here. Just fine. Stand like that. I'll work on it. Put together. Yeah. No, 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 don't start. Stay right on. back here. Stop. I'm sorry. I'm I just said stand stop. there. Stand, okay? Can you take a deep breath for yeah. me? Please? I'm just mad that my friend, her dad is a cop, but she's the one. She's not drunk. She is. She's the one that drove me home. Give me that DUI. Alyssa Listen. Blank, she drove me home. We're not, we're not That's my that niece. Right That's fine. I don't want her to get in trouble. Is I want you to hey, I remember okay? you. And cool. I remember Troy. And I remember everybody. Can we just That's listen fine. to her? Yes. I'll put it up. Yes. Focus. Yes. I'm focusing. You want to go? Yeah, hold on. He's going to grab me a sheet. I just, it's. That her dad is a cop, so she's getting away with this, and she drove me home. She got a board in here by chance? I don't have anything because of the freaking we're in the under brother. You need a blue pen? No, I got it. I think I'm okay. All right, Sam, I'm Deputy Oliva with Flag County Sheriff's Office, okay? 
Today it's uh, October 31st. Yeah, now the first. Yes, November 1st, 2022. Yep. 2021. I got you. I'm not drunk. She and drunk. It's 4:01 uh, a.m. Okay. Yes. All right. I'm right home, a mile up the street. I just want to go home. She All right. me home. She used to be fun to go in the club. I'll take her out to court. But I don't go f out. Yeah, would you would you listen to me please yes, and stop so stop yes. okay your eyes are beautiful, yes. stop yes. all right state your name for me. how old are you 24 and your date of birth yes. do you have any problems with your back legs or balance not no no are you, are you not being treated by a doctor or anything like that yeah but no okay that's what I need to know. Okay, I'm gonna demonstrate some field sobriety exercises yeah, and then good. ask you to perform the exercises, good. okay? Yeah, you're good. Do not begin or attempt the exercise until I tell you to begin. You're good. Part of my determination of whether you're intoxicated or not is your ability to follow instructions. Do you understand? I got you. Will you attempt these exercises? Yes, yes or no? Yes. Okay. Alright, so the first thing I'm gonna check is I'm gonna check your eyes. Right, do you wear contacts or glasses? No. Okay. Not that I'm a no. Not that you know of? No. Oh, you would probably know, no. right? Okay. Yeah. All right, so what you're going to do is you're going to stand with your feet together, arms at your side, okay? Keep your head still, and I'm gonna, it's gonna, you're going to follow the tip of my pen with your eyes, okay? This is tip of my pen. See it right here? All right. And you're going to do so until you're told to stop. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Okay. I'm All just right. making sure. Next exercise. You ready? Yeah. I'm walking. And I'm straight. I'm good. Bravo, I'm 24. Ready. If nobody buys FSEs, we can. Uh, next one is going to be the walk and turn, okay? So I'm going to demonstrate. I'm not going to be on the line, but Let's I'm going to demonstrate it. how it works, okay? Stay right there. All right. You're going to stand with your, again, stand with your feet together, arms okay, at your sides, okay? 54 FSE. Foot after foot. Yeah, just stop. Hold on. No, stop. I'm getting there, okay? okay. Alright, so you're going to place <clears throat> your left foot on the line. Yes, sir. Okay. And you're going to place your right foot in front of your left foot with your heel touching your toe. Do you understand? Yes, sir. See? Just like that, okay? Look. Yes, sir. Alright, with your arms at your sides. You maintain that position until I tell you to start. So go ahead and do that. Arms at your sides. Okay. Right, and we got it, right? And left foot on the line, right foot in front of your left foot. Sir. When I tell you to begin, you're going to take nine heel to toe steps on the line. And you're going to take nine heel to toe steps back. When you Sir. turn, you keep your foot on the line and turn by taking a series of small steps with the other foot. So it's going to look something like this one, two, three, four, five, five right? right. And then you're going to leave your foot on the line and you're going to take small steps while keeping the foot on the line. Yes. One, two, three, four, five, until nine. You understand? It's this yellow line right here, okay? All right, so do you understand all those instructions I've read to you? Yes, sir. You understand my demonstration? Yes, sir. Okay. So you're not 
you're not really understanding because you got to stand in that position, right? So, uh, yeah, 12, 9, I got you. So left foot, right foot in front of your left foot, and now begin. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I'm telling you, I got you. I know what I'm doing. I'm not going to lie. Keep going? No, you can stop. Is my mom still here? And it's my... Brothers, throw me home till here. Mm -hmm. I'm taking the blame. Mm -hmm. I heard you on that. Mm -hmm. It's hurt. Uh, mm -hmm. 54. Mm -hmm. No, it's 10 for Yeah. I'm not going to say that. She can't do that. Yeah. She didn't stop. She didn't step off the wall. Troy, you still in Indiana? Is that good? Starts before it's thin. Hearing. She didn't use her arm. Okay. She did not touch heel to toe. <laughs> Incorrect number of steps. She did it one, two, three, four times. Five, five, three. Three times. Sure. Okay, just pay attention here, okay? Let's try a few more things, okay? So we're gonna do it again. You stand with your feet, just stand back a little bit. You stand with your feet together, arm at your sides. Okay, and do not begin the exercise till you're told to do so. Do you understand? Yes, Alright, when I tell you, you're gonna raise one leg, whichever one you want, okay? Yes. Approximately six inches off the ground. So it's about maybe about that high, okay? Not yet? Yes. A little higher, about six inches, about a soda can. Yes. Alright? You're gonna keep your foot parallel to the ground. You must keep both legs straight and your arms at your sides. When you're holding that position, count out loud in the following manner, 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, until told to stop. While you are counting, look down at your raised foot and keep your arms at your sides. Do you understand? Yes. And just keep walking in one foot? Well, I'm going to demonstrate for you, okay? okay? All right. You're going to sit like this. Any foot you want, right? 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, oh, while yeah, looking okay, at your yeah. foot with your arms okay. at your side, 1,004, right. 1,005, yes, until I tell you to stop, okay? Do you understand? Yes, sir. All right. When I tell you to begin, then I want you to begin, okay? In one spot, stand. One spot, raise either foot. Yes, sir. And start counting, okay? Yes. You may begin. So again, we're going to stand with your feet together, arms at your sides. All right, so what we're going to do is you're going to take the tip of your finger, which this is the tip of your finger, right? This is the pad, okay? So you tip of the finger to the tip of your nose, okay? So it's going to look like this, all right? So stand with your feet together, arms at your sides, and do not begin until you're told to do so. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Is my 
dog okay? Yes. All right. When told to Got begin, uh, I think I listened. So when told to begin. Oh, the girl that drove me home. Okay. All right. Go are ahead. we gonna? Do, yeah, are you go gonna ahead. listen? Yeah, I'm listening. Are you sure? Because it doesn't yeah, seem like you. I'm positive. I just can't. Right. She drove me so, home, but she's gone. When told to begin, you're gonna close your eyes. You're gonna tilt your head back. Okay. I'm not closing my. I'm, don't begin yes, yet. Yes. Uh huh. All right, I'm not going to close my eyes for safety reasons, okay? Yes, sir. Tilt your head back, and you take the tip of your finger, and you're going to, I'm going to say left or right, and you're going to go just like that and bring yes. your arm right back down. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Okay. If you say left, left. Yep, left. so after you touch, automatically return your hand back to your side, wait for the next command. Yes, sir. You'll be asked to do this three times with each hand, okay? Yes. Do not open your eyes or tilt your head forward until everything's over. Do you understand? Yes, sir. All right, tilt your head back, close your eyes, arms at your side, feet together. Okay. Left. Uh huh. Okay, put it, you remember what I said, put it down after touching. Right. Right. Left. Left. And right. Okay. Okay, you can relax. I can hold it, I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, she did not write just the time on that one. Just the timing on that one. Okay, so I think we got enough of winning. Is that all? Mm -hmm. Go ahead and tilt your head. Later. What's up? This, this is this big bike. Go ahead and tilt your head back for me right now. What? Tilt your head back. Tilt your head back. Close your eyes. Count backwards from a thousand. Okay. Thousand, nine hundred ninety-nine, nine hundred ninety-eight, nine hundred ninety-seven, nine hundred seventy-eight, nine hundred seventy-nine, nine hundred seventy-nine, nine hundred seventy-eight. Well, let me tell you what's happening. You're being placed under arrest for DUI. Okay. Huh? Why is that? You were, well, let me just. Well, tell you. I didn't drive. Hold on a second. So you don't have to drive. You have to be in physical, actual physical control of the vehicle. So vehicle this running. Let, 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 let me finish. Let me finish. Let me finish. He literally saw you in the driver's seat vehicle Alyssa running. Alyssa drove me here. You're not hearing. So call my mom. Why call my mom. Call? Oh, we're not doing call that my again. Because she, Alyssa, has her dad as a f cop. Right so she drove me here. So that's cool. Probably two twenty-four flight. Why am I getting a Come on. Come on. That's half all the. But Alyssa's dad and she's cool. Cause a day blank is her dad. Has nothing. So call him. So call him right now. No, before I get in the car, call him. No, no, call. Call Dave, bro. Where's my mom? My mom is just here, bro. Where's my mom, bro? No, where's my mom, bro? Where's my mom, bro? Get in the car. Record this. Where's my mom? Get in the car. Where's my mom? Where's my mom? Where's my mom? Where's my mom, bro? Where's my mom? You're gonna get another chair. Where's my mom? So where's my mom? In the car. That's fine. I'll let her talk to you. I'll go with it. Where's my mom? Then go. She's right over there. Where? Get in the car. Sit down, please. Sit down, please. Sit down, please. Oh, where's my mom, bro? Karen was definitely more than just a little lit, and thus bombed the field sobriety tests. She was taken away for DUI and rumor has it that her dog has asked her for a divorce.